In this video, I'm going to show you how easy it is to use Google Classroom to send your students a template to fill out. This template could be a hyperdoc or it could be a template slide presentation that you've started to put together and you want the students to fill out their own information. It's very easy in Google Classroom to make a copy of that template for each student. So let's start by creating an assignment. We'll click the plus sign and select Create Assignment. We'll give the assignment a title and we'll add some instructions. So you can see in the instructions, I've given them some very specific instructions. The first thing I've told them is to click open to open the attached template and you'll see why that's important in a minute. Now I need to attach my template to this assignment. So my template is in Google Drive, so I'm going to choose the Google Drive option. I have created a slideshow that I want them to add their own information to. So in order to do that, I need to change how Classroom is distributing this file. In this case, I want Classroom to make a copy for each student. That means each student will get his or her own copy of the template to add their information to. I also have a rubric for how this project will be graded that I want to attach. So I'm going to go back to my drive and I'm going to find the rubric for this particular assignment and attach that. In this case, this is information that I just want students to be able to view. I don't want them to be able to edit this file, so I'm going to leave the share setting. Students can view the file. Now I can continue attaching documents or I can even attach a YouTube video or a link to a website for them to review. I can uh, have multiple attachments on one assignment. So when I'm ready, I'm going to go ahead and click Assign. Now when we take a look at this on the teacher dashboard, we will see that we have the assignment and we see on the teacher side, we see both attachments that we have given our students. If we look at it, this assignment from the student's perspective, we will see just a little bit different. Um, so here I am on a student's account now and we can see the same assignment. Notice that on this assignment on the student side, I can only see the rubric that I attached. I do not see the template. That is why in the directions I put click open to open the attached template. Students will not see the template that you attached unless they click open or until they click open. Once they click open, they will see in the work area, here is the template that I have provided for them. What I really like about this is that it automatically adds the student's name to the file name so they don't have to remember to put their names on their papers. Again, when a student is done with the assignment, they will need to click turn in so that you as the teacher can see it has been submitted. So remember, on the student side, they will not see the template attached in the assignment until they click open. On the teacher side, you see both um, attachments that are, or all of the attachments that are listed on the assignment.